Good morning, here's my outfit of the day. It is pajama day at work, so I am wearing some pajama bottoms that my brother bought me from Disneyland a couple years ago. I'm actually wearing just a regular gray t-shirt um, with the pants and a black cardigan sweater and my Tom's flat tennis shoes, whatever you wanna call them, and just a black beanie just to stay a little bit warm. I am so comfortable if only every day was pajama day. I will talk to you guys a little bit later. I have never been more happy to drive to work than I am right now because the sooner I get to work, the sooner the day is over and the sooner winter break starts. And I just, I just feel so good right now. Like nothing could upset me. I'm going to work in my pajamas. It is a minimum day. I will be off for like two weeks and I fully intend to do a lot of nothing for those two weeks. <sighs> it just feels great. It just feels great. So I made it, you guys. I'm there. It's the morning of winter break. Like, I have to go to work, but it just, it, like, as far as I'm concerned, I'm mentally on winter break already. So I'm excited. We're going to have our treat exchange this morning. Um, we're going to watch A Christmas Story, which is one of my all time favorite movies. I can watch that movie all day long. And uh, <laughs> I'm going to go home and I'm going to probably take a nap. I'm just so excited. I don't know if you guys can tell. So. I just got on here to tell you that. I'm just that excited that I wanted you to just know it and feel it and just just be excited with me. So, um, also, I forgot to tell you guys in the hustle and bustle that has been this past week, um, my sister, I, if you watched my house tour, I explained that my sister will be moving in for a little while because she would like to now start saving up for her own place. Um, and I think that day is today. So she was driving from Texas with a friend. I believe she will be in California today. So um, starting, if not today, in the very near future, you might see my sister pop up here and there in vlogs because she will be living with me. She is a nurse. Um, so that's exciting also because our family is now officially reunited. We are a party of five again there are three kids and my two parents and she's been away for a very long time much too long we've been trying to get her to move back to california um for a long time and that is finally happening so i'm excited for that too. it's just a great day all around i just don't even know what to say so oh and there's pe in the morning like uh, the kids go to pe from 8 35 to i think 9 25 so the, i it, it I just, I'm speechless. Um, a shout out to our PE teachers who come in, they come in twice a week, take our kids for an hour, but because they're so nice and they were, um, at least the head PE teacher was once a classroom teacher, so she fully understands the, the need for time. So she's giving us an extra, I think 20 minutes or so today. We normally only have an hour. So she's giving us an extra 20 minutes. So needless to say, I am in the holiday cheer. I still don't have any Christmas presents. I don't know what's going to happen, but it just, nothing matters. So I hope you guys have a great morning or a great day, and I will talk to you guys soon.
Hey there, it is 3.54 and yes, I'm still at work. Students were dismissed at 1.15 today, um, but I decided to just stay and knock out my progress reports in terms of um, deficiency notices. So my progress reports are done in the sense that I have my grades updated, but for students that are receiving anything lower than a C, we have to give them an additional report, which is called a deficiency notice which just lets their parent know that in this one particular category, they are receiving lower than a C minus, or lower than a C, so a C minus or below. And um, we leave comments on there as to what we think the issue is and give some suggestions on what they should do. And so I was typing all the comments for that. So that is why I'm still here. I'm fine with that because now that means I can go on break and not be worried about those looming over my head. So right now what I'm doing, and I think I'm the last person here, which is kind of depressing. I only see my car in the parking lot. What I'm getting ready to do is I'm getting ready to pack up my gifts that I got from students. Um, as always, like I said yesterday, I always feel so love during the holiday because they don't have to think of you during the holiday. They don't have to give you a gift. But if they do, that means they care enough to do it. And even if the parents, even though I know the kids aren't buying it, but even um, for the sake of the parents, they don't have to do it, but they do. So I appreciate it. So I'm just packing those up. They were very generous. I don't really want to go over what all I got because that seems kind of odd to me. Uh, but they treated me very well and I feel very appreciated. So I'm just going to pack those up. I am going to order a salad for myself from Panera because I haven't had lunch. I did not eat my lunch. Um, I didn't even, I won't even say that. I did not eat my lunch um, because I just didn't feel like it really. I didn't eat my lunch because I didn't even have a lunch. I didn't even pack myself a lunch because I knew I was just going to go home and have lunch. So I'm going to order myself a salad from Panera as a treat for making it to winter break. And then I'm not going to do anything. I'm probably just going to sit on the couch. I'm going to wait for my sister to get here. Uh, what I will do is I will probably respond to um, you guys' comments on yesterday's Vlogmas and any other one. But that's the most that I'm going to do. Um, I have my little list here of gifts for thank you notes. I do recommend that. Like if they give you a gift, normally I open the gifts in front of the kids because they really like to see what you got. But we just ran out of time today. The treat exchange took a little bit longer than I thought. And then I wanted them to be able to watch the movie. So while they watched the movie, I opened up the gifts and made a list of who gave me what so that I can make sure and write them a thank you card. And I actually need to buy more thank you cards because I ran out. Um, what else? And that's really it. I'm just so very happy you guys I'm, I'm sure you know if you're a teacher and you're on break you know the feeling so I don't even sorry I don't even know that I'll check in anymore today because also I, I'm pretty sure my sister will be arriving at some point and um, we need to help get her situated so just in case I am going to say goodbye here I'm just so happy I'm going on break for two weeks and I won't be doing anything. I'm not lesson planned, but that's okay because a lot of what I thought I was gonna do this week didn't happen with the marathon testing that was going on. So it's just gonna be a lot of carryover. And if worse comes to worse, when we come back, Monday is a minimum day. I know what math lesson I'm teaching. Um, and we have library and then Monday we come back as our prep. The, you know what, I might make some math videos. I might, but then I might not. It just depends on if I get to a point where I feel like I need to do something productive. But even making a math video isn't that bad, sort of. But I just, I'm just gonna say goodbye. I hope you guys are having a fabulous day. Thank you for giving me all the moral support and encouragement to get through this week because I have made it. I hope that you guys enjoyed this vlog and I will talk to you tomorrow on my first day of vacation. Bye, everybody.